Yo yo what's up my name is Nguyen and welcome back to another video on my YouTube channel. I create a new hair tutorial and I hope you like the video. Today I cut a mid skin fade and make sure to watch the video to the end to see the transformation. I hope you like it. The first thing I do is spray his hair with the water spray bottle so that I can separate it better. Here I separate his top hair from the profile areas. I start at the crown area where his natural hair growth begins. Then I use hair clips for his top hair to separate it from the profile areas. After that I can start it to begin to fading. Here you can see I use the clipper overcome technique for the highest point of his profile area to make a good base for the next steps. It makes me easier to fading. At first I take my number 2 guard, it's 6mm on my wall magic clip cordless lever close and cut 1cm under the highest point of his profile areas. I began from the left side to the head and neck and after that then to the right side. The next step I create my first guard line with my wall match clip cordless, no guard, lever closed. A good tip for me, always use a hairbrush, so you can brush all the little hair away. It also can make you a really fast progression to fading. NVD. Here you can see I used my brown series 9 shaver to trim away the tiniest trouble under the first guard line. Don't use the trimmer like a machine, because if you do that, you create a new hairline and it's very difficult to blending. The next good tip is move your shaver in slightly circular movements. If you do that, you don't make new lines. Give it a try, it is really helpful and therefore saves you more time. The next step, I take my warm magic clip with the number 1.5 guard, it's 4.5 mm lever open and use the down fade technique. I blend the 1.5 into the 2. The best is when you cut with your clipper in a C motion of his head. So it is better to blend and don't create new lines. Here I take my wall magic clip with the number 1 guard, it's 3mm, lever open and use the down fade technique. I blend the 1 into the 1.5, it's also the same, cut it in a C motion of his head, so it is better to blend and don't create new lines. And yeah, you can see I use the lever open with the 1 guard and then I change it to the lever closed. And I make this from the left side to his neck and back head and then I changed it to the right side and make the same technique. At first lever open and then lever closed. Here I used my warm match clip cordless, no guard, lever trigger play. Why trigger play? This step is for the most people really hard to blend into the fade 
for example from 0 to 6 mm. I use that word because in this step I don't can say to you ok, now you cut with a lever closed, then open. That's not correct, buddies. You must play with the lever. It's ok when you start with the lever closed, then change the lever into a half and then into open. But the key is you have to develop a feeling for it. At the same point you will understand why. You have to work a lot with your eye, because only you can see if the first guideline was blended or not. The next step is also very important. I use my War Magic Clip Cordless 0.5 guard, it's 1.5 mm lever trigger play. Here I work for the details. I make two steps back from his head to see the haircut from other position. It's really helpful to see the fade and also you can see dark areas and then you have to do the work and blending. Now I use my scissors over comb technique to cut the hair a little shorter at the highest point of his profile areas and make it also softer. Here I use also the scissor over comb technique, but I change my scissor into a thinning scissor to make it also softer from the profile areas at the highest point of his head. So for the contour I use my Andy Slimline Pro LI trimmer. It's for me one of the best and sharpest clipper in this industry. Here I create a hairline and slightly into a C form. For the top hair I start from the crown and divide a 2 cm section of hair horizontally and comb it at an angle of 90 degrees. And then I cut the hair with the point cut technique. And then I go a little further and share the new cutting length and an old cutting length. Then I do exactly the same. And here you can see when you comb your hair at a 90 degree angle, the new cutting length and then you know how much you have to cut. I do the system until I reach the forehead area. Now I blow dry his hair into the shape what my customer wants. In this cut I don't style his hair because my hair styling products was not here to use. I'm sorry, but for the next hair tutorial I make also a nice hair styling. And yeah buddies, this was the cut. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you like it, feel free to leave a like and write your opinion in the comment section below. Buddies, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel to don't miss any more videos in the future. I wish you maximum success in implementing and stay healthy guys. We will see you soon again in the next video. Space, good body. You ain't just my honey, yeah. I like Cardi. Label in this bunny, yeah. Bad Hadid. Talking on me. Bad on me. Tokyo Street. Is it love? Charlie, is it love?
Take my classes on. I can get.